Yo, what's good guys? I hope you're all having an amazing day and welcome back to another video. Today is actually a really exciting day. We should be able to finally finish all of the caves we need to do to run in the brand new Gilroy's built transmission in my Ford Falcon. So um, to celebrate that, I thought I'd get a few more parts ready for the Falcon, ready for its next step, which is making it ultra reliable. Um, if you guys have known the Falcon for a while, I chucked a few extra horsies underneath the bonnet and uh, ended up breaking it pretty much within the month. So I have probably had it longer broken and not running than I have had it running. And it's actually a beautiful day today. So we're gonna head up to the Sunshine Coast hinterland and go out for a drive with my good, with my good neighbor, <laughs> with my good friend Riley and his girlfriend. So um, yeah, anyway, I got an extra little package in the mail today, which I really want to show you guys, which is going to be uh, installed hopefully very, very soon for the next step with the Falcon. So a few months ago, I ended up hitting up Golby's and they were pretty keen to get on board with the Falcon after helping out Adam with his Barra GT350 over in the States. I hit them up and I said, look, you guys have done such an amazing job and they decided to help me out with my Falcon build as well. And we ended up getting a brand new atomic timing chain kit ready for the Falcon for when we put our Dominator Motorsports billet oil pump gears in. So we have everything here ready to go. We have the two guides here. Um, we also have the tensioner plus down here, I'm pretty sure. Yep, this feels like a chain. Let's have a quick look. There you go, our brand new timing chain. So we're gonna be putting this in very, very soon. I could imagine in a couple of weeks time, we're gonna be heading down to Gold Coast to go catch up with our good friend, James Nolan, and also Tom. And hopefully they're able to help me out with ripping the barra out of the car and we're going to be going over everything, fixing up the snap stud in the exhaust manifold. I'm also gonna paint up the block and do a whole lot of stuff in the engine bay to try and fix up that, uh, that burn damage. And then also we're gonna be putting in the brand new atomic timing chain kit and the Dominator Motorsports uh, oil pump gears. But uh, yeah, anyway, today we're gonna be going up to the hinterland, gonna be going and doing some filming, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's finish off these Ks, and then we can get the car tuned tomorrow, and boosting again tomorrow. I'm so keen to have the Falcon back. Man, I've missed driving this thing. Believe it or not, it's the first time it's ever gonna go to the mountains uh, after it caught fire. <laughs> yeah, sick. Okay, so we are up in... <laughs> Jane, it hurts. Why do you have your glasses so much. far down your face? Because then I can do this. <laughs> so we are... What you are look we just... like an old grandma, love. What did we just pass through? Mulaney. 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 We just passed through Mulaney. And we are heading, actually, change of plans, we're heading to Kenilworth. Yeah. Get camp. Apparently there's a sick bakery out there, so we're going to go hit up the bakery. And get fat. We have 200 Ks left. I'm at 1,296. Which means you have 200 Ks left to hit our 1,500 deadline. Woo. And then we can go get a tune. And we're going to go have Woo. a fat bakery feed. Yeah, we're going to go have a fat bakery feed. Get camp, boys. That's as much as I can do right now. <laughs> it sucks. So good. I just wish this traffic would clear out. Yeah, there's heaps of traffic. Oh, did I tell them that Riley was coming too? Yeah, he did, yeah. Oh, cool. Well, yeah, they motorbikes up there, but we're like a car behind. Yeah, And the car awesome. in front of us is going so slow. So slow. They're going, so, they're going Sarah Steve. Sarah Yeah, speed. we're doing Sarah slow. Sarah speed six. Sarah speed slow. <laughs> so, yeah. But no, it's a beautiful road. Check it it's out. Really it's really nice. It's like amazing. Sunny Coast Hinterland is literally where I would live if I didn't live in Brisbane. Yeah, it's so nice. I'll try and get some good clips for you guys. I'm sure you will. But yeah, as soon as uh, as soon as this is over, I think we're gonna go do a quick little run through Mount Me. Um, Are we? Sarah's yeah. Sarah's never been through Mount Me, um, and I was always worried about police being up there and being able to defect this car if they really wanted to. But it's definitely not the case. They will 100% not defect this car. And. Uh, after driving the Skyline, I feel like I'm driving the most amazing car in the history of the world, so. That is true. Yeah. I'm on board with that statement. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, we're just cruising. Just cruising. How nice is this, though? It's so pretty. After all the rain and stuff. I didn't realize we're going through Mount Me. Yeah. We're doing a huge drive. Right. Okay. So I think, uh, what is it, about half an hour from here? Yeah, I think maybe 35 minutes. Sweet as. Yep. We'll pick up when we get to Kenworth Bakery. Yeah. I don't know how these rotors all hold up. 
but I'm sure we'll be fine. Let's go up the skyline with the we'll the skyline to take this, no worries at all. We'll be losing our lunch. What do you mean? Look at over there. Whoops. Skyline's beautiful. Look at this road. Hey, Just gonna send it at 80. No, it's like right. <laughs> Look, I did, I did one, I did one group event. I can drive as fast as I possibly can. I bet everything. What's that? Rightio, you Bobby. <laughs> me and my hot pink great break. Uh, me and my hot pink brake calipers have made it all the way to Kenilworth. Looks real nice and pretty sitting out of here. So does the Harley. I don't know if I've showed you guys the Harley before. It is beautiful. It's like a like a rosy brown color, all matte. Looks freaking awesome. See, so yeah, that's Riley's bike. That's what we we're following the whole time. Man, she looks pretty. Woo! Love it. <laughs> I could imagine the aircon's nice in this. <laughs> so this is a what is it? Creme brulee donut. Creme brulee donut. We should just send it. That's what it is. Oh, no. Ever since we decided to do the P.O. Box stuff, it has been so crazy. Just the sort of stuff that you guys have been sending me. Like some crazy things. Some really nice, you know, letters and stuff like that. And I cannot thank you guys all enough. Doug, are you really peeing right there? On my camera? Really? No, in all fairness, guys, thank you so- Don't eat that! That's a letter from someone, Doug. <laughs> no, in all fairness, guys, thank you so much, everyone, for sending me all the stuff. Um, if you guys do want to get involved in the P.O. Box stuff, please do check out the address in the description. Um, yeah, you guys are all amazing. Thank you so much. Before we get into today's video, I really want to start opening some of these things so that way all of you guys can see what we got. I know one of these I've seen before, um, it was actually from a video that I'm not going to tell Sarah about because she has no idea what it is, but it's going to be amazing. Alrighty guys, so I guess we'll start off, like, we, we got three things in the PO box today. Look at this! Let's go smallest to biggest. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Alright, let's, let's check her out. Are you still chewing this bit of Yeah. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> you put it in. Dear Zach, my name is Flynn. I live in Victoria. And I'm sending this picture to your unboxing vid, um, so I hope you like it. And Zach, you should get a, you should VA swap the BA and take it to Summer Nats or Rocky Nats um, as a burnout car. What is your favourite car brand? I have to say it's a, Fal a Ford man, but dude, thank you so much. Look at that sick picture. That is wicked. It looks yeah, it is I an XWGT. I just think it's really cute how we like tried to ride on the back. <laughs> it's so cool. And I also love the plates. Look, Zach351. Do you know what 351 means? Um, no. Okay. It's, it's a GT thing? Yeah. It's a, it's, a, it's a GT thing. GT thing. Oh, that's really nice. Thank you so much, Flynn. I appreciate that, dude. I really, really do. Alrighty, on to number two. And this one here is from Anthony. Now, I have absolutely no idea what this is, but judging by I that think right it's there. A, it's a Hot Wheels car. Another one to add to the Yay. collection. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. Oh, it is a hot whisker. Alright, we'll, we'll get this out first because oh, I, so nice. I want to read this first. From Anthony RC Boys. Like I have seen you come up on the. <laughs> God, it's annoying. Going up to yoga. I have seen you on the uh, on the live streams very recently, and massive thank you to coming out and supporting all those live streams too. We'll read this little package first. Yo, all the drawings. Look at this. He drew my barra shirt. How sick is that? To Zach Baldy, my name is Anthony. I have been in some of your live streams. Hey, as RC boys. Um, you're my favorite YouTuber and I watch your videos all the time. Um, I love your Falcon and your Skyline and I'm happy that you got a Civic and I want you to jump it. Hey, I, I'm glad someone else wants to jump it. I hope you like what I sent you and I hope you, Sarah and Doug are all safe. That's so nice. From one of your biggest fans, Anthony, 12 years old. Dude, thank you so much! That's, so nice. That's awesome. I really That's honestly so cannot amazing. thank you enough, man. I can't give that to Doug. That's so nice. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you so much, Anthony. Now we're gonna find out what Hot Wheels car this is. I hope it's a good one. Doug! 
<laughs> Hell yeah, man! It is a Volkswagen Beetle. Oh my god, I cannot wait Very to chuck that up. Luckily, do you not have one of them? No, we don't have one of them that as well. Out of all the Hot Wheels, do. out of all the Hot Wheels we have, we do not have that one. Dude, thank you so much. That's cool, thank you. Okay, do you want that though? Go for it. Oh, you can have this one here too. Oh my god, he's nuts. Now this one here is one that I've actually seen uh, on in the internet before. Um, it actually went kind of viral as well, which is pretty sick. I reckon, yeah, I reckon Sarah's really gonna love it. So this right here is from Joel. Now I'm gonna link his Instagram and everything in this video. Um, Cause this is sick. This is- <laughs> careful. What? Careful. What are you doing? What is your goal here? Get knife. <laughs> you always said to me. Oh, sorry. Thank you, Douglas. Douglas Judith. <laughs> okay, I'm removing you. Okay, removing Doug removing from the Doug picture. This is in there like nice and tight. Yeah, okay. yeah I know. Hey. Doug! I almost cut you! <laughs> Make sure you always cut away from yourself. Alright, Sarah. Oh, I'm not actually done with the knife. Can I, ha can I have the knife? Yeah. Perfect. Another. my framing right now. I won't show you guys just yet until oh, I get the whole thing out. So oh, my okay. I love it. Okay, so let me take a second, guys. Bear with us. Oh, Doug's never seen sticky tape oh, before. You nailed the frame. You must have been watching the videos because that's the kind of framing I have in my house. So thank you. You did very well with that. This is certainly going to be used in the bedroom, guys. I love it. Gonna hang above our bed. Wait, Dougie. <laughs> What's that? Once I get stuck to him, it's gonna be so funny. <laughs> okay, goodbye. Okay, have fun with your sticky tape, Doug. Oh, I love it. Oh, it so you haven't seen this, have you? It's painted. Really? Mm-hmm. That's so nice. So we're doing a whole lot of drawings today, and I will admit, it's all, the drawings, all of though. yeah, all of them have been amazing. This one here, I've actually seen on TikTok and Instagram as well. I'm emotional. Um, and it went a little bit crazy, but this is a hundred percent like painted, a hundred percent painted. I don't know how well you guys are able to see this, but Joel has actually painted my falcon. And it is so insanely realistic, it is just nuts. So this right here, as I said guys, is an ultra realistic painting of the Falcon. Now I'm not gonna lie, I am dying to get one of the Skyline now as well. But if you guys want this bloke right here, um, I have to actually go and have a chat to him as well because honestly, I just kind of saw this online on TikTok actually, and I was absolutely blown away. I could not believe that someone had actually wanted to paint my car, especially someone that is this talented. But guys, if you want anything done of your car, make sure to go uh, have a chat to Joel. That is insane. I love it. It just kind of looks like the Skylines in the reflection, but no, I don't know what that was. <laughs> no, it's a Renault, I think, or something like that, like a Master or something. That's, That's so crazy. Cool. Look at the detail in that. I want a Skyline one because it would match the aesthetic of the white. You can have this in your study and the That's Skyline crazy. can be That's crazy. Do you want to go hang it up? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. it. That's crazy. Alright, let's go hang it up. For Sarah to say that she wants this in the bedroom okay. is like the biggest compliment you could give to anyone. Because <laughs> if you've seen our bedroom... Just look at all the... This is all the so, stuff. So this is, this is my study, right? So I have this. Um, don't have anything up there just yet, but we have this. We have like my MCM poster, all my Hot Wheels cards and everything. So this is like... This is like the colourful room, right? And then we come in here, and this is Sarah's dungeon, where everything Dungeons is different. white, it there is the nothing. Frames, though. It's like identical to the frames. Actually. I know, it is absolutely perfect. So, we've been wanting to have a horizontal one over there, because those ones look good above the bed, but that one looks a little bit lost. This is gonna look so nice. Do you want me to put it up where you feel? Mm-hmm. Go You'll for it. it. Have fun. Here's some tree down. 
peasantry. <laughs> wow. Are you okay with having this in the well, bedroom? I'm actually sure because we've been hanging that one by that thing, so I'm not sure if we need another one or if Just do it from the very top there. How's that? Pretty good. The left needs to go down a smidge. Go down? Yeah. Really? Yeah, just a smidge. Alright. How's that? Step away. It kind of ruins the colour scheme, but I mean... That's crazy. This is a vibe. Wow. Happy? Joel freaking nailed it, man. That's crazy. You can see like all the little <coughs> tiny individual brush strokes in it. 